my hi everybody. My first poem is a quite short one. <coughs> it's called The Old Man. Look at them, the old men on their benches, staring at nothing you can see or I, dreaming young dreams too late, their shrunk haunches shivering in the clutch of the cold day. What is it they see, those eyes, unblinking, dull, where once a vivid lifelight shone? No point in wondering, no point in thinking. Wait, be patient, we will know too soon. The next one. I wrote a while ago, a little bit longer, it's called Glittering Prizes. She promised to write home. Her mum and dad waved goodbye and wiped, wiped away a tear. Living, living in Diggs surely wouldn't be so bad. She'd probably get time off once a year. Her name in lights, that's all she asked. One try at the big time, her date with destiny. But oh, she said her heart's on passers by and dreams aren't quite what they cracked up to be. She thought he might be working for a while. Some minor parts weren't all that hard to get. She wrote home with an optimistic smile and lied about rehearsing Juliet. In point of fact, the truth was rather sad. Passed around at parties, she soon got to name as the good time that everybody had at weekends. Oh well, it's a sort of fame. There were not much to write home about, I know. One dismal sherry sodden drama queen and her drug riddled Romeos drinking to forget, remember, something in between. And the third one, uh, I wrote this, I wrote this um, a while ago and I was feeling rather under the weather. I had a very, very heavy cold and I was feeling very sorry for myself as only blokes can. <laughs> and, and I wrote this from my bed of woe. It's called Battle of the Sexes. Chronic cystitis, migraine, housemaid's knee, strategic headache, thrush, and PNT. All these ailments, dear, I'd gladly leave to you, but I've got a market cornered in man flu. <laughs>